So, um, uh, first of all, I want you to tell me about your work, which is um, to do with, yeah, go for okay. it. Yeah. Uh, glasses on, glasses off. Glasses on is good. Okay, cool. Um, yeah, so I, I, I kind of came across um, K4N3's work um, about six months ago. I was, uh, you know, I was walking in, um, walking in Newtown one day, and I just saw this piece. It was actually this one here, which we've then taken off the wall. But um, I saw this piece, and I thought, you know, it really stood out, and it was just so different. And I thought, you know, damn, that guy, you know, he knows, you know, he knows what it's about. You know, he just stood out from all the other crap on the walls, you know. And I thought I had to work with this guy. I mean, I didn't know it was a guy then. I didn't, you know, I didn't find out until much later, and I had to go through a few people and just to meet him. But uh, yeah, no, I just thought this guy's got it. And I thought, well, you know, maybe we could work together. Um, so you know, what I'm doing and hoping to do um, is a kind of transmedia kind of, you know, augmented reality kind of layering kind of stuff is my thing. And, what we want to do is bring the experience of experiencing, uh, you know, K4N3's work to a much wider audience, but keep it exclusive, keep it really underground. So it's going to be the sort of thing where we, you know, appropriate this particular piece and we're going to take it and we've scanned it in, we've kind of wireframed it, we've made some sort of 3D models and we're going to be projecting those around the city. Um, we're going to do a lot of hit and run kind of on the fly stuff. Yeah, um, yeah, lots of lots of on the fly stuff. We're going to do it really down low. We're going to run off batteries. We're going to hit and run. You know, the cops aren't going to stop us, and we're just going to you know slam this stuff against against buildings. You know, the stuff that you know I know after talking to him. You know, this is the stuff that he would want to be able to do. But there's only so high you can reach with you know a, a spray can. You know? So, but also what we want to do is do this kind of. Uh, this layering, this real virtual kind of world okay. element to it. We're going to have, uh, you know, kind of augmented reality kind of apps. We're going to be, you know, we're going to be in the ice, you know, the, the app store, you know, with Apple. You, so you've got your iPhone and you, you know, you know the right place to go to. So you go to this wall and you sort of hold up your phone and there, bam, is, is the work, you know. It's going to be right up in your face. It's going to be there and it's going to be living and you can hold it and you can take it home with you and you can tweet about it and you can tell all your friends and, you know, you can Facebook it and, and you can four square it and stuff like that like that'll be really kind of really exclusive and underground and cool but you know also selling apps and stuff which would be great um, so that's where we want to go with it you know we're gonna that's that's moving right ahead you know we've got the wireframes we've got the we've got the 3d models you know this really big 3d model of just that you know it looks great it's right there in your face you know it's just kind of coming at you it looks fantastic, you know. We've done a lot of really good work already, so that's, you know, keep an eye out for that. Cool. <laughs> that was a work of art, thank you. Thank you, that was beautiful. Ah, oh, outstanding. 3D model. 